tension. It's the essence of great filmmaking. It's the tightrope that keeps us on edge, uncertain of the outcome, but eager to see what happens next. One filmmaker above all others mastered this art, Alfred Hitchcock. So long as I'm making that audience react in a certain But what way. exactly is tension? And how did Hitchcock use it to turn simple scenes into heart-stopping moments? Today, we explore the secrets of tension in film, starting with Hitchcock's famous quote. There is no terror in the bang, only in the anticipation of it. Alfred Hitchcock. Hitchcock loved to explain the difference between suspense and surprise. He often used the example of a bomb placed under a table. Imagine two characters talking about baseball in a diner, unaware that beneath their table is a ticking time bomb. Now if that bomb explodes suddenly, the audience experiences surprise. It's a quick shock, but the feeling is very fleeting. However, if the audience knows the bomb is there, but the characters on screen don't, every second the characters spend talking becomes agonizing. That's how you create suspense and tension. Now take the same scene and tell the audience there is a bomb under that table because they're saying to you, don't be ridiculous, stop talking about baseball, there's a bomb under there. Now the only difference is, although I've been guilty of in the picture sabotage of making this error, but I've never made it since, the bomb must never go off. <laughs> Hitchcock said the bomb must never go off, but why? Because the longer the audience waits for something terrible to happen, the more the tension builds. Hitchcock was a master of using the camera to control what the audience saw, and more importantly, what they didn't see. In Rear Window, Hitchcock traps us in a single room, just like the protagonist. We only see what he sees, making every glance out the window feel like a life or death peak. By limiting our view, Hitchcock creates tension in the unknown. In fact, he once said mystery is an intellectual process, but suspense is an emotional one. Another tool Hitchcock used to masterful effect was silence. In Psycho, there's no score leading up to the famous shower scene, just the sound of running water and Marion's mundane actions. Music in film is just as important as the director's choice of shots. Sometimes what you don't hear is more powerful than what you do. It's the silence that unnerves us. We expect something to happen, but Hitchcock drags it out, making the audience squirm. And then, when the tension is at its peak, the music stabs us like the knife, amplifying the horror. Hitchcock's lessons on tension still echo through modern cinema. In a quiet place, the silence is a deadly weapon where even the slightest noise could lead to death. Ah! Much like in Hitchcock's work, it's not the creatures themselves that create the fear, but the dread of their arrival. In No Country for Old Men, Tension comes from the quiet menace of Anton. His calm demeanor contrasts with the audience's knowledge of his prior acts of ultra-violence, creating a ticking time bomb of a different kind. A coin toss. I don't know, I couldn't say. Call it. Call it, yes. For what? Just call it. Whether you're working on a blockbuster or a no-budget film, 
you can harness Hitchcock's lessons to build tension in your own work. Remember, tension isn't about what's happening, it's about what might happen. Use your camera to reveal or hide critical information. Let the silence speak louder than words, and always keep the audience one step ahead of your characters. Always make the audience suffer as much as possible. Alfred Hitchcock in the end, tension is about control, and as Hitchcock proved time and time again, the more we wait, the sweeter the release. I hope you've enjoyed this breakdown of creating tension in films the Hitchcock way. Now, go make your audience squirm. Hey guys, Ryan here. Before we go, if you want to dig even deeper into building tension and suspense in your films, I have a more in-depth video that you can watch right here. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next video. Bye bye.